It's not a good day today, you know? Just ride with me, man. We're on the way to San Diego. That's my grandma right there, man. I always talk about she. I just wish she was here to see all this that I've done. And Three of them, the guard. It's just perplexing that every time I jump out the Rari, jump out the Rafe, they're like, damn. Big who do you play for? You know? Damn. That nigga ain't play no sports. The guard. I didn't play no sports to get the Rolls Royce. Rolls Royce. I didn't play no sports to get peace, prosperity, positivity, and progression to all. Benz. I didn't play no sports to get the man cheese. Yeah, I didn't play no sports. I didn't play no sports to fuck that bad bitch. I didn't play no sports to get filthy rich. I didn't play no sports to live like this. Yeah, and they want us playing ball just to get our wealth. Five years later, we broke with bad health. I'm talking, no one cares. We got bad weed. I'm talking, no one cares. We got mouths to feed. Yeah, we on the sideline with the pain. We can't even walk straight. We feel the pain. I have no fear, Mr. Organic is here. Listen up, guys. Ain't no extra curricular intro today. It's not a good day today, you know? Um, got my brother with me. I just see we in all black. You know, today is one of my um, aunts. Funerals, so we gotta head down to San Diego and go to the funeral, of course. And um, what's crazy thing about it is, the night before the funeral, we get a call that my uncle had a massive stroke too, Uncle Bruce. I probably saw him in a couple of videos and all that. And uh, so we gotta go to the funeral today. At the same time, he's not looking so good, you know. So prayers up for him. Hopefully he pulled through, you know what I'm saying? We'll stay positive, but yeah, it's a real time right now. So, you know what I mean? I gotta give you all the good, the bad, and the ugly. I gotta give you everything that's part of, of this life, you know what I mean? So, just ride with me, man. We're on the way to San Diego, you know, south used to be exact. And uh, the day gonna begin with us stopping at the gas station, filling up these cars, heading down to San Diego. Three of them. The pure one. Go to goats. Believe in yourself like you believe in God. So I'm gonna leave from you. So it's like a two hour drive. Let me see that next year. Hopefully. Yeah, we're traveling, but that is huh? But yeah. About this, it should be about two hours. I don't know what um, the traffic looking like right now, but we're gonna figure it out. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. Alright, so it's cold a little bit. Shoot. Man, but uh, yeah, we're gonna take both of us down there, you know, just make sure, uh, you know, it'll be a good send off, give her a good look on the way out. The dawn is nice and, you know what I'm saying, washed up. Yours not. You know what I'm saying? It's still dark out. But uh, yeah, man. We're on the way to Dago, man. Southeast to be exact. You know what I'm saying? One of them days, people. You gotta keep your head up when everybody else head down. You know, sometimes um, you gotta be tested in life. But at the same time, when stuff like this happen, you just gotta know, man, it's part of life too. It ain't like simple, but you gotta know, it's part of life. So you gotta brace yourself for it and prepare for it. It's 100% guaranteed. Yeah, you can't, you can't skip this step, you know what I mean? So anybody out there, make sure you're living right now. Don't be waiting, don't be thinking, don't just be out here surviving, do what you really wanna do. Go see what you wanna see, go touch what you wanna touch. For real, it's like, um, cause you might not never get the opportunity again. You never know when it's your time. So move like it's your last days, you know? And um, appreciate when you do have help. Appreciate you when you do, you know what I'm saying? Able to do the things you always dreamt of. You, especially your body moving right and all that. Take advantage of it, man. Cause you never know when it's your time. All right, so hop in this whip, man. Head to this gas station. Uh, uh, from the sea to the roof, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. yeah. I'm manifesting all my greatness. It took 10 years of grinding just to. Alright, man, we set a mouse. We on the way to Stego, man. RP to Auntie Cookie, you know what I'm saying? Roots get well. Hope we get some better news when we get there. But we on the way, man. Everybody should be there. All the family. So, just riding out, man. In the 
most prestigious way possible. Rolls Royce and Lambo up. Uh, it was two hours and 36 minutes. Might be a little traffic, but normally it's been two hours, so. But it is what it is, man. I'm cruising out. I turn this back on, I turn it back on. But right now, it's riding out. The day goes, man. There you go. The world is yours. Tony Montana, ghost statue, marble floors. Yeah, the world is yours. The world is yours. Ghost statues, nigga with marble floors. Yeah, I'm Sosa. I got the keys. Sosa. DJ Khaled gave me the major key. Yeah. Three up. God, uh, 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 talk to a nerd. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. From the seed to the root, the tree to the fruit. I'ma keep it organic, keep it organic, yeah. Why do you think I keep getting so much? Yeah, man. So we here, we in Dago right now. Just reminiscing, looking at some of these old spots. You know what I mean? The old Coke factory is going there and still sold us. Now the chip factory too is going there and still from there too. Big stealing. <laughs> a lot of stealing. A lot of stealing was going on. Out of necessity though, but like, just doing it. I had to get it. Made it be necessary. So, yeah, we're only like five, six minutes away from where we're going. But yeah, man. We in Dago for sure, for sure. It's crazy memories. I remember all this stuff when I was moving, but it's crazy when you see it, you just like, yeah, you know, we keep it real. I remember somebody just asked me when I ever coming back. I'm like, I hardly ever come back. Uh, back today. I've been on good terms. I feel I'm too grown to be going back somewhere. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's why I asked, like, what I'm supposed to do? Come back with no intensity. Right. Come back and get love. I don't know these people no more, man. I'm family, you know what I'm saying? God bless you. All right. Hopefully they ain't in the same spot. In the same spot we grew up, man. Right. If you got something going on, you want to come down, then we can work that out. But it's for the own reconnaissance thing, but it's cool though. Uh, dope. There you go. Yeah, but it ain't the best circumstances to come down here as of right now. But you know, we're here now, so we're trying to make the best of it. You know, see a couple of spots where we can grow it back. Go to a couple of the parks. Situation with some dignity and understanding. Over here, definitely give you some road talking on the way out. You don't eat them no more? Yeah. But these are the real deal ones, though. Yeah, the four corner mom. Yeah, yeah. That's the one. Ain't no better, ain't no greater. That's the spot, bro. Huh? I just ain't, I haven't seen them. Oh yeah, because I, I came back a few times. Yeah, you've been back way more, man. I've been back forever. I came back a few times. Black Dog in San Diego. Remember I came back and shot that California Dreams, you know? Remember that? Been back that little documentary? Back. I haven't been since like 2011. Yeah. Me, me, Chelsea, Bobby. Oh yeah, but yeah, yeah, a long time. I forgot. Yeah, Brittany, yeah. Went to the, we went to the zoo, I think. I think came there a few times, a lot of times, yeah, actually. I haven't been since like 11, bro. Like over two years. Yeah. I remember that. The Bruce was in there with me. When they did the California Dreams joint, that was hard. Put up to the crib and all that. Talk to Dante to do that on the um, barbecue spot. He's a, he's a love my game. Nigga, like, type booster. Make sure I have bread and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. This is the best. Ain't, ain't nobody ever better than him going crazy. It's wild. So I'm definitely gonna try if I got time to see some different places, you know? Depends on how this day go. I'm sure there's a lot going on right now. Gotta drive out of Uber. That would made me fully understand who I was. It used to be at them practices though. That's why I, I, I forgot about. I mean, I've been forgetting. They used to be there every day. Me and Alex going crazy every day. Your house, the apartment was right across the street down there. Right? Yeah, down the street, grandma and yeah. apartment. Yeah. And then Bobby apartment too. They both yeah. were right there. We used to smoke over here each other too. Just sit, down, sit down, down the corner yeah. and just be crazy. It's be crazy times. That's a fact. Smack a couple people sometimes in practice. I played too much, but it, and it, you can't do nothing about it. Like, shout out to my guy Rome. He called me before on Facebook. I forgot about that whole incident. He was like, "Remember you faked the ball at me and slipped it in my face, and I squirted with you, and then he punched me." I'm like, "Dang, I did!" Hit him like three times, quick. 
and it was my fault the ball slipped right here. But you shouldn't got mad, dude. Like, relax. You know how you fake the ball? And it slipped out and hit him, bomb. And he get, but he trying to square with me, though. Like, what you trying to do? Yeah, he can't, though. I gave him that three piece, nigga. That's even worse. You should have took the ball. He tried it, though. He would have did that G for you if he did. Oh, uh, them times be the, be the life battle. That's what I'm saying. You, you got you playing too much anyway, it's right. Yeah. But he should have known, like, oh, it's three up. He tried to know, but he was cool. I mean, he, like I said, he called me on. It's on one of the videos, y'all saw it. He called me about it. Organic love to him, though. Yeah, you know? yeah. yeah we was kids, bro. I didn't mean no harm. I was ignorant, man. I was ignorant dude. But I do love my coach, though. He let me do whatever I wanted to do. What was that coach? I don't even remember. Forgot his name. He just said, this is what we do. Give Jarvis the ball. That's all I know. I, that's all I appreciate it. I appreciate that, man. That's the kill. But we ain't went that many games. I made it better than it was. I think y'all went 500, bro. Yeah, yeah, right. So and it was just, I was me going crazy. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I made all conference. Made uh, honorable mention, mention all city. You know what I'm saying? Top 10 in the city scoring. They couldn't get me all conference because, you know, our team was weak. But I was there. I mean, all, yeah, all city. All close. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, for the pull up where my mom is at, the dad department, I know um, I'll talk to you guys then. For y'all. All right, we're here, man. In the heart of the Southeast. You know what I mean? <clears throat> I mean, last time we was here, the guy was at the window again. Yeah. Not the it was school in? Oh, yeah, school in, huh? Yeah, it's school, bro. Damn, what is today? Thursday? All right, we're here, man. My Deuce over there. Uh, talk to the family a little bit. <clears throat> One of them days, man. We're gonna make the best out of it. You know what I mean? <clears throat> what time is it? Uh, so the service starting like an hour. We gotta drive over there and all that. Yeah, I have no fear. What's going on, champion? Not much. Thank you, Yes, sir. Yes, sir. My dudes. Yeah. How you feeling? Loving your fit. Thank you. Yeah. One of them days, huh? Man, taking my brother out too. I know, it's crazy. Y'all are making make sense. Love you too. Love you too. I'm gonna head to the weight. There's my sister Jade right there, Jade Black. Don't play with it now. There's my little sister now. She ain't to be played with by nothing. She legendary. You know what I'm saying? She legendary, but listen up, boy. One to one. You know what I mean? But yeah, we finna head to the weight. Let me see if I can do this. I did it before. Watch this, man. I got some new I do. Look at the car. Transforming. I do it with my mind. You know what I mean? Uh huh. I do it with the brain. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I take the top off on him. Let it shine down. You know what I mean? So yeah, I got the dawn on him. I'm going to the weight. You know what I mean? Just give y'all some perspective. Nothing too crazy, just, you know? Life. Life is everything, man. Everything come with it. Oh, the good, the bad, the ugly, man. And it's one of them ugly times, man. You know what I'm saying? Prayers up for my guy, Uncle Bruce. We used to hoop all the time out here. Adams Park, well, that's Adams Park, right? Over yeah, there. Adams? Adams is crazy. I don't remember the park name, bro. Oh, you don't remember Adams Park? We used to, we used to ball at John Adams, boy. Oh, I used to give him. I used to kill him at John Adams. My, my, my guy Bruce would be with me every day, going crazy at John Adams. Giving him no mercy. Zero. <laughs> they gonna get it. Yeah. Oh, Miss City was, woo. I am Miss City. That's how I ran to Marcus, yep. Mid City, I was there every day, all night. Michael will tell you, let me talk to Michael. I stole them weights from the school. I was being in the house just pumping weight all day. I gotta be strong. I gotta be strong. And drinking creatine and juice, eating cookies. Every day. Uh huh. But all right, man, we finna head there. You know what I'm saying? Michael, what's up? You gonna ride me, dude? Look at Mike, that's my cousin Mike right there. <laughs> Listen, I wouldn't be me without my cousin Michael. You got to know, he was the best basketball player, the best hustler, fly, had all the girls. 
Rolls Royce. You drive slows in these. <laughs> but super legend. I like that. So he, oh, he like the yours, huh? That's a fast one. <laughs> it's crazy, right? Look how far we come, man. See the interior on that joint too? With the steering wheel and all that? Nah, you gotta see the full shebang on that thing, man. Oh yeah, I had to play with the Chinese dudes. Yeah. Dang, that's crazy. Yeah, I, was, I, I wasn't playing with them. Yeah. I was flying in yeah, Hoover. Shirts, bro. Brand new ass polo shirt. A lot of shirts. Damn, Shoes and everything. Yeah. I was not playing in Hoover. I was going to Hoover like, you know what I mean? For free. For free. For free. I had a, I had a good thief guy. I had to go with him and steal him. And we used to take it back to the store, get the money back, then get store credit. This is high school. This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Always been. But I learned from him, though. You need to be yeah. ridiculous. Master hustler. He's always been the same. So we always been the same. Always. Right. Always. Right. always. It just worked out, man. And, um, I don't know how. You know, God is great, man. Too bad we had to reunite on this on this day like this, you know? Man, I ain't tripping. Yeah. I just got to make the best of it. We're going to make the best of it. You know what I'm saying all this, all this pain, gotta be something on the horizon for us better. Did you sure. talk to me? I know. I did. Yeah, yeah, I talked to you. I know. That's crazy. I know. Wow. And it's on his, it's on his birthday today. What day is that? Hey, life is hard, man. Life is real. That's why I'm trying to get get my body in shape. That's I mean, why I, see, that's why I be in there. Oh, you gotta make sure. I don't play well, about you've it. You've been doing that since high school. I understand, but that's doing. why I always did it though. What are you doing, Joe? Okay, I stole, listen, my high school, I stole weights. You know what I'm yes, saying? Because I wanted to work yes, out. I was being in the house all yes, night, just pumping away. I had my creatine and my juice. Yes, he did. Pumping away. Go to the gym with the ball. Hoover High School. Hoover High School. Go to Mid-City Gym every day. And they loved you. From the seat, they and loved you. you left their ass. But I, I killed, and then you left. We were killing. You, you killed, killed and made them something, left. and then I left them. Everything happened for a reason. I, I, I just felt that was the best thing. We were starving at the crib, though. We were really hungry, man. You know? Well, you, are, you was not ever there. I was by myself. I'm coming in, nigga, with the plates. What the hell you be? Well, you, every now and then. Yeah, you were with grandma. Shit, ain't no food there. What you talking about? I'm not standing there. <laughs> I'm not standing there. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, going down that hill. Going right? down the hill. The school's on the left side. We used to be there every day hooping, too. Yeah. Going crazy. Yeah. We did a lot of hooping, boy. I was saying all we, all we ever did. Not no NBA players. Right. We had the caliber, but no one went to the NBA. Right. We definitely had the caliber, but we had too much ignorance, especially me and my blood. I couldn't. It wasn't that. There wasn't no guidance. Wasn't no guidance. Yeah, we, we came from nothing. Like, wasn't no men. Wasn't no men around. And all we knew was each other. We, we come on, bro. Like, how old was we when we was really running streets and we was in Milwaukee? Like, like riding off, dude. Like, eight, walking, nine years old. Walking way to Chuck E. Cheese. Come on, man, catching the bus and all that. We kid kids. Like, and doing was, whatever. You was the baby. I was the baby, right with y'all. Besides Trent. Besides, the Trent never really went. No, he was. We protected Trent, you know what I'm saying? Trent wasn't out there like us. Say, man. But it's just crazy that, yeah, we, we was we was grown from kids, but like. Hey, I'm straight now. Straight, yeah, straight now. We're gonna get even straighter though. So we're gonna fix everything. We gotta go through to get to it, man. Which is a terrible thing, but that's how it go. I hate it. Uh, right. Man. That's it, boy. Listen, world. And then, and then, you know, Bruce. Bruce. My nigga Bruce, dog. That's my dog. That's hurtful. That's my dog, Bruce, man. We talk the most when we when I come here, when I talk to Bruce. We get all the good talks. Yeah, you like that yours, huh? Yeah, I got the little rock mark on that thing. Oh yeah, March, yeah. You can play with me. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. You can't do that. You'll get that fixed there. Yeah. Oh, that, all that. Oh yeah, they love the God now. You know, that's what they do. But we on the way, man. We talk to y'all when we get there, man. We keep it a real cool aesthetic, man. Everybody stay prayed up, stay positive, no matter what. There y'all. They pray, they pray, they pray, they pray for me to fall. They pray. But I ain't never stopping, dog, no, nigga, no. Uh -huh. They pray, they pray, they pray, they pray for me to fall. Bill was a killer. So remember, because we was at the gym at the rec, and I'm killing everybody. Like, brutal. you was sitting there, and we got done. Me and Bill got done killing. You was like, he said, and he calls me at the same time. How how that work? How that work? How that work? Watch this, Bill. That's great. I told you, special, bro. 
Yo, yo, yo. What the fuck? But listen though, I know that's crazy. I'm in the car right now with Mike Miles now. Billy the Billy Billy the Billy the Beast. That's crazy. He like, man, I ain't seen Billy in a hundred years. I said, Bill, Bill got it like me. He got the bread too. I ain't asked about it. I just I said, said, how you doing? But I, I bring it up. You already know I got to bring it up, man. We was hooping, killing Troy Machado and them. That nigga Michael looked at it and said, man, y'all better than him. Wanted it more. Like Wanted it more. We have more attributes. They already, they, you know, they already had fans. Right. That nigga said, man, y'all way better than them. We killed them niggas, man. And y'all was some trees. And we were some trees, and we was way more athletic, way more dog, way more retarded. They didn't have it like us. Yeah, yeah, y'all, yeah, was more retarded. Yep. Where is, where is Bruce right now? San Diego. Yeah, in San Diego, man. He, he, he yeah, he's out the hospital, man. You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, we we uh we just pulled up to the mortuary right now, bro. I hit you when I'm done. All right, go. What's up, guys? What's up, man? How you feeling? All right, bro. Yes, yeah, sir. Love. Let yeah, me put these joints in the front, man. Make your cookie looking good in style, man. Close off, dude. Side parking. I mean, I'll put them joints right there in the front of the building, man. I'll put a cookster. Killing all the other lambs, slaughtering them with the big with the big minotaur. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? A vivid picture. All that retardation paid off, Mike. Yeah. All that differentness. Yeah, dude. Right. Ain't no change, dude. Nothing changed. Just the pocket. Just the pockets. Just the pockets. <laughs> that boy been the same weird though. Change, <laughs> <for real. laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've been the same guy. Y'all had to change. I changed a little bit, got calmer. All right, man, we finna pull up here, man, three of them. Yeah, we about to go inside. There's my auntie Rita right here. She, she active, always giving love in the comments and all that. She was always there. She had them hands, too. You still got them hands, Rita? She'll be punching somebody in the head. They got to mess with you. She had them joints now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She just punches in the chest. Stand them up. Come here, boom. That was beautiful. That was. You know I used to kick y'all in the... Okay. Right. Yeah, yeah, but she keep that quiet. But she was, she wasn't that older than us. Oh, I was going to tell you. What's up? Do you remember when I took you guys to Sinbad? Yep. And um, y'all danced with the ladies yeah. on the show. I remember that. And I, and it came out the, the Vibe show. And we went there. And, and Kenny Ivory Reigns. We went to both of them. Went to both of them in LA. Yeah. That was hard to have us on TV. I remember yeah. with the Hoover the next day. Like, it was on TV. Michael, you remember that? You were dancing too with those went ladies. Went to the Sinbad the show. <laughs> and, and the Vibe. <laughs> Went to the vibe. I just want to point that out. That was legendary. I was dancing in my day. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, they, they got to get them stories. They don't be knowing. But we got yeah. the broken them candy machines and got all that candy in the, hey. the, the, the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I know. But all right, man, we finna go in here, man. Talk to y'all. Uh. Got God on my side, needed no one else. Everybody that I needed, they was never there. Was lost in the dark, now my vision clear. Was lost in the dark, now my vision clear. Al Poe, when it's prime, doesn't homicide. If you play the streets right, rich, gotta die. Gotta have a Wayne Perry that's gonna ride. Rather be in a cemetery on the car. Put myself in the game, no one sub me out. Was shooting in the gym, no one helped me out. Believed in myself, that's without a doubt. Close friends turn to foes, what I'm talking about. Good girls turn to hoes, you know what I'm talking about. Nobody ice my knees. You know what I'm saying? Everybody did a great job. Uh -huh. We here. My Duke's here. What you like? What you smoking on? Something to make my nerves calm. What's that? The, all them little Indian moves yeah. you smoking? I don't smoke no weed, but I don't know you talking about. Jay got the good <laughs> marijuana. <laughs> you remember you came to car with them? Smoking. Jay, you going with him? Jay was shy because she should be smoking oh, yeah, anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jay was quiet. Huh? You going to go smoke with him? Jay was shy. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, tell him I'm oh, in there. Fuck. Why are you doing that? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we got to go to the to the cemetery. That's that's cool. I got to I gotta see Grandma anyway. I, mean, I, ain't seen, I ain't seen Grandma in a while. That was years ago when I came back to that little documentary. That was dope. About that time, man. So that's what we're on the way to, man. My grandma said I was born a king. Told me I was special. She was right. Three of them. Yeah. Yeah. Three of them. Mind, body, and soul. Chase the greatness. All those. You're born great. I swear to God. Everybody just ain't great. My grandma told me that. Listen up, people. Um, as I'm reflecting right now, you know. I just think about everybody else in the world. Make sure that you know what you want to do just in case you ever pass. So for instance, you want a funeral. Me, I want to get cremated. I don't want nobody to spend all that, my insurance money was going to be a whole lot of millions. Don't waste it on my funeral. I just want to be cremated. I'm going to have a statue made. 
You put my little jar inside that the gargoyle statue, close it up, boom, seal it up with a key. It's already gonna be taken care of. So make sure you prepare yourself for when you pass that you make it easier on your people. You know, make sure you got the life insurance. Make sure, you know, the things they want them to say about you. You want all that already lined up before you go. You don't want to wait till the last minute. That just goes for anybody in life. Um, I'm just reflecting on it right now because I know I already told my family what to do with me if anything ever happens to me. So you got to be on top of that type of stuff. So anybody out there, make sure you, you uh, checking on your insurance. Um, got a will written out. Got a trust. Checking on all that stuff right now. It's okay. Don't like put it to the side. You're going to need that. And you want to make it easier on your people if anything ever happens to you. You know what I'm saying? Young or old. So make sure you do that now. Get that taken care of because it's very important, man. So like I said, we're on the way to the to the cemetery now. I get to see my grandma and lay my aunt down. Um, still prayers are for my uncle. You know, and I lost the other uncle too. Um, my uncle James, you know, RP to him. He lost uh, like uh, last week, his funeral was on the 24th. And even reason I named Jarvis, my uncle James and my auntie Ernestine, they had a son named Jarvis, but he passed away like at birth. So they named him Jarvis. My mom was so close with her that she named me after him. And that's how I got my name and that's how I'm here. And he always loved me. Like he always held me in high regard. He passed away not too long, like a couple of weeks ago too. So his funeral on the 24th. Now my other uncle, he in the hospital with a stroke. Like what this crazy world, but you know. So prepare for things now, not later. You know, make it easier for everybody. That's right, man. See you guys in the cemetery. Bring on. My grandma told me I was born a king. My grandma told me I deserve a queen. My grandma told me I'ma see the top. My grandma told me I could never stop. My grandma told me, yeah, my grandma told me. My grandma told me, yeah, my grandma told me. My grandma told me, yeah, my grandma told me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She told me it's a clear world. Flower shop. Um, my grandma is buried right over here, right by my auntie. So it's only right to get her a nice little bouquet for the for uh, her gravesite. So that's what we're about to do now. Get some good flowers and all that. Three young, um, y'all. Three young. Um. Can I want these right here? Pardon me? This right here? Yeah. The price? Nah. Let's get it. <laughs> the price don't matter. Oh no, it's for today. Yeah. I know. Oh, this can get the display. Get it now. No, it's just like um. Oh, you gotta make it. Yeah, this is like the sample. Right. Yeah, because they made it with natural flowers. Oh. It's just to the people see oh, about the sample. size. And you got anything like that that's ready right now? Just the only the ones thing here? that yeah. here. Yes. Oh, okay. That's the only for now. That one, then, huh? Yeah. Big dog. Yeah, I go with this one right here. Grab it with Or that right? What's this? Nah, it's wet, man. It's wet. You just grab it out or what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, perfect. Oh, y'all put it in something or something. I don't know. <laughs> grandma, grandma always told me, yeah, yeah. I got this from grandma. It smells good, too. She put the little perfume on there. I'm trying to do smells good. I ain't gonna lie. Don't kill me, brother. You heard them ladies say I look good. You got that on tape for read. I think so. Oh man, for real, <laughs> missing the good stuff, man. The lady was saying I look handsome, man. You know what I mean? All of them. All right, man, so I'm gonna put that over at my grandma's spot. You know what I'm saying? She deserve it, man. Grandma always believed in me. For real. Bobby Brown lifestyle, after new edition. My prerogative to see my dreams to fruition. Carpal tunnel, counting money makes me humble bad. Bitches by the bunny king of the ring, let's roll your road. Working hard, nigga. That's all I know. Oh, smell good, boy. Smell a little too good. My God. My grandma told me I was born a king. My grandma told me I deserve a queen. My grandma told me I'ma see the top. My grandma told me I could never stop. My grandma told me, yeah, my grandma told me. That's my grandma right there, man. I always talk about she won that basically bleeded me the most, even when I was the craziest, doing wild things. She told my mom, allow me to be me. I'm special. 
And she was right. Why she tattooed right there. Opal. My fallen angel. Boom. Opal May 2006. And she died like right when I first moved to Minnesota too. So yeah. I just wish she was here to see all this that I've done and get some of these experiences though. So but she see it. I wish she was here to, you know what I'm saying, really enjoy it because she would have a good time. She always had a great, you know, super good energy. She loved music, rap music too. Her favorite rapper was 50 Cent. 50. She like 50. That's probably why I like 50 too, huh? She was bumping the 50. Oh, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So she deserved that. Some good roses for her, man. R.P. over May. Everything she want her king, make sure she receives. Sleeping on a bed of roses like Prince of King. Without the cars and the clothes, high self esteem. But yeah, um, you know, monumental times. It's got to mind you, like, it's moments. Black Bizzle, there go Black Brandon right here. This is my older brother. What's up, everybody? How everybody doing out there? That's who got that superstar Hellcat. How that car ride? I always ride smooth, you know what it is. Come on, man. You be racing people or no? Yeah. Every now and then. Uh, if they got a car, they got, if they got yes, a car Yes, he racing. He racing, he's got a stunt on him. <laughs> he racing. Yeah, I'll, I'll race if it ain't got to be worthy, if though. Be worthy. If it ain't got a red eye, they even. Buff on the side. It got to be the extra. They got to have the BBL meter read. <laughs> got to be buff. We can't do it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man. Um, that's it, man. All right, my auntie, she's taking take it down. One thing about her, she lived her life, like ups and downs, left and right. I just knew her as a top level hustler. You know what I'm saying? And like my cousins, the Jazz and Michael, they're like brothers and sisters. We grew up together almost the entire time, lived with each other a lot. So we was basically brothers and sisters. And um, she was always there. You know, she did what she had to do. She was a hustler in and out, but man, she was legendary. And she definitely lived her life. And um, like I said, the last couple of years, she'd been pretty sick. And um, since 2019, I think. So when it's her time to go, it was her time to go. But she definitely lived her life, man. So other than that, man, we're getting up out of here. I'm gonna go get us something to eat or something. So as of right now, man, we're gonna end this vlog, man. R.I.P. Grandma, R.I.P. Auntie Cookie. You know what I'm saying? Prayers up for my dog, Uncle Bruce, R.I.P. Uncle James. It's getting weird, man. Hey, man, y'all better cherish Mr. Organic while you can, man. You know, time waits for no man, for real. People coming and going, but hey, I appreciate you guys for allowing me to live my dreams while I'm here, you know? I ain't gonna never, 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 never take that for granted. Utter appreciation from the sea. And look how I'm riding, man. You know what I'm saying? What you wanna do? You got a Lamborghini and we got a Rolls Royce passing each other like this. Choo -choo. You know what I'm saying? Look at this meet and greet right here of cars. Watch this meet and greet of Brick. Three up. It's a therapeutic situation, you know. It's all about blessings and reflections, you know. Like I'm already in a race from just sitting up looking at the stars. Visionary. Gargoyle gang gang. Gargoyle gang gang.